السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته. أشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له، وأشهد أن محمدا عبده ورسوله، اللهم صل وسلم على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين. الحمد لله. سبحان الله. We all hear about إخلاص. We all hear about sincerity. That we need to do things for the sake of Allah سبحانه وتعالى. And most of us, alhamdulillah, we think that we are doing the right thing, that we are doing ikhlas to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But wallahi, brother, when I read this, uh, these things from uh, real, what is ikhlas, I found out that myself I need to work a lot more than I thought. This ikhlas deal, this sincerity, it took it to another level. Subhanallah. And I realized that the ikhlas that I was doing was not the one that I was supposed to do. And Subhanallah, uh, and most of us are like that, except that Allah Subhanahu wa Taala has has rahma on. Um, so we know that ikhlas. You know that ikhlas. Um, it is to do something that you want Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alone. You do it for the sake of Allah alone. Um, but ulama, the, the scholars, they said that uh, the people, when they do something, they do it for the sake of Allah, and obviously as well for them too. For example, somebody is going to Hajj, he's going to do Hajj, and he is, and he wants his uh, sins and all that to be forgiven as well. So this is a, 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 a niya, an intention that everybody, where you go in, you do it for the sake of Allah and you do it for yourself. But uh, the, the sincerity comes in on this one here is,